Hello, welcome to my first YouTube video. I hope you like it. I'm going to be touring my Willy Wonka chocolate factory so far. So let's see if you enjoy it. As you can see, I have the chocolate room behind me. You'll see that in more detail later. So stick around and find out how we start. Let's go. Okay, so first we have the Wonka's Welcome Song Room. As you can see, I have put some dispensers in that do the little sparks things. And the throne at the end made out of the new bamboo. A little separate room here, get, taking us into the um, well, entry room. And I've used some pots for plants here. So let's go down. Crouch for emphasis. So you can see it's getting smaller and smaller. Clever little hidden door here. Boom. Look at that beauty. Wow. Made the most of some of the new flowers. Um, we've got shroom lights, mushrooms, custom mushrooms, and a pipe which we can go in right now. So we can actually go under the water. I've made a little tunnel here. You can follow this and it leads all the way up to the pipe. And then if we go up, we can actually see the chocolate room through the pipe. And it's quite awesome in my perspective. And then the top bit. We're very high up now. the way down and back through the tunnel as you can see I've changed my skin so I'm just going to redo that and back to the next bit so I think the next thing we're going to do is we're going to um, look at the boat I've made so let's just cross the bridge Let's look at the waterfall from here. Keep going. Look, fun fact, if you're ever making your own chocolate room, mushrooms grow better on mycelium because I don't know if you knew that already, but it's helped me a lot. So I made a little dock area for it. And it's actually functional with minecarts. You can not you can take all the minecart railings off as well and use it with a boat. I just feel minecarts are kind of better for steering. And when I did it in my other worlds, it wouldn't let me turn all the way around. So, let's go. I'm approaching the tunnel. I think I did a really good job on this. Don't forget to like, video and subscribe if you haven't already. This channel is fairly new so you might not have done that yet. A little detect rail system. But we're not going that way, we're going down here. So we've got coffee cream, coffee cream, we've passed whipped cream and hair cream. Kind of difficult to tell because it's on a slant, but hopefully you can get that. And next part. Turn to it. And yeah, 
again. Now, I think I made a big oopsie with the like, centerpiece here because it's on a different angle. So, the moment we get onto that projector right here, we get into the inventing. Okay, so here we are. Mm. Trying to fit in sleeve. And have a little explore. Some of the blocks glitching, but that's okay. If we click the sleeve, we get some hydrogen. So I have the education edition on. And that's some more scientific stuff, really. We've got everlasting gobstopper. We just jump. There we go. It's all fixed. Uh, I do have other pressure plates as well for different types of gobstoppers, but that's the main one. And I've used some more pads in there, just some as a feature of ones, because I didn't really know how to get any heads on my bedrock edition. So here we go, gate gun machine, turn it off, see all the different flavours here, and pop, here we go. Now I've used something you can actually eat, so if you eat it, I stand in the pressure plate, you get teleported inside the blueberry, which I think is really cool. I've used blue terracotta, if you don't know what this block is, blue terracotta. If you're making your own, that's a nice one to have. And let's have a look from a top view, up here got some little lights so over here and there's one over here as well light bulb <laughs> and we go all the way up and it changes from polished andesite to glass so you can actually see underneath oopsie okay let's try that again <laughs> the scaffolding And, yeah, let's just be a bit more careful this time. Well, for those of you who are wishing to know how I light up most of my stuff, um, I use light blocks. So, there are different versions you can get. You can get all the way from the 0 up to 15. And you can actually phase through them, which is really helpful. And they disappear like barriers when you're not holding them. So, that's the plus side too. So let's go to the corridor and finish with the inventing room now. All the way along. And there we go. So we're in this bit now. Go here. We'll explore that door later. And close that. So now we are in the, the nut sorting room up here. And we can actually jump over the gate and come down here. Um, I've yet to add all the squirrels. Well, technically we haven't got any squirrels in Minecraft, but we can have a look in here. Made it a bit more immersive by putting this a bit lower. I shouldn't have done that. It looks a bit weird. We jump back over the gate. And to the elevator, which I've yet to do. So, I hope you like this. So, I hope you enjoyed this part of my Willy Wonka chocolate factory series. I will be doing more of these if you like them. Always upgrading and seeing what you can do with different types. Maybe we can do boats, maybe we can do minecrafts, minecarts, and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Goodbye!